you can take this test right from your living room. This is a simple game, really. All you have to do is tie two ropes together. But the problem is these two ropes don't easily reach each other. So that's going to require you to come up with a creative solution. You have the chair, paint can, and a pair of pliers that you can use to solve this problem. Take a second and consider what you would do to tie this five-foot rope to this four-foot rope. Keep trying as these college students also take on the challenge. Do you understand what you have to do? I got you. Tie the ropes together? Yes. You can't reach both ropes from the floor, but simply standing on the chair won't help. You're going to have to get creative. I'm going to tie the chair. Okay. <laughs> Seem impossible? We assure you, it can be done. <laughs> yeah, it's not gonna work. Do you feel like giving up too? Well, before you do, let's find out what might be standing in your way. When you're trying to think of the uses for the objects in the room, you have a hard time thinking of a use that you haven't encountered in your lifetime. You're not born knowing what a paint can is, but over time, you form associations, such as what a paint can looks like and how it works. Object association is an activity that takes place in a region of the temporal lobe. If we can prime people to think of a can of paint in a completely different way, that can really help us solve the problem instantly. So, how does this apply to the ropes challenge and the objects provided? First, you have to add weight to one rope to create a pendulum. What can you use for weight? Here's where that creative thinking comes in handy. You've gotten very close. You're very close. Swing the paint can pendulum. Then, while holding onto the other rope, stand on the chair and catch the pendulum as it swings in your direction. With the ends of the ropes now in close proximity, you can release the paint can and tie the ropes. Yay! <sighs> okay. You got it. Yeah! Did it! Good job! <laughs> That was not easy. <laughs> have you ever used a paint can as a pendulum before? No, I have not. Is it the first time? Yes, it is. I need to get in the gym. <laughs> I did yeah, that! Yes! Congratulations on completing the Total Mental Fitness Challenge. The two ropes problem required your concentration to slow down and take in the details, and your mental flexibility to stretch and find a creative solution.